Kelly has an interview at Lululemon <clears throat> today at 11. She is nervous. We found a bag in somebody's in the stall, so we're trying to figure out. Security? We're trying to figure out how to get it to the mall um, security so that we could give it back. Okay, so I brought it into security and they, I guess, are looking at it right now. Um, I didn't open it, I didn't do anything. I just wanted to um, get it somewhere, but I was like running around the mall and I was trying to, I was worried somebody was going to find me and be like, you got my back and blah blah blah. But um, we just brought it down to security and I hope security can get in contact with them so that they can get their, their back back. Um, I didn't look inside, so I didn't know if there was a wallet or a phone. That belong, like that it belongs to um, security can call them. Be like, yes, I think what it is. I was like frantically running around the hall trying to figure out what to do. Because I didn't know where security was, but you need to see something. I guess we go over clocks in our living room from here. far today and so I just need to fix my hair a little bit so while I was fixing my hair I thought I'd update you guys um, as you probably can tell um, this is a two-day vlog um, in one and um, yesterday I just didn't do very much and um, didn't have really anything exciting to tell you guys or you know it was just yesterday was just yesterday um, but I did come back to Adrian's house we went to a, a Thai place with two of his friends and I really adore his friends they're like family they're really awesome and so me and Adrian and two of his friends all went to like a Thai place that I was able to get like pretty easy to digest food um, nothing like spicy or anything and um, I did have to medicate myself a little bit to be able to eat, but it was really, really good. And um, the food everybody else got was really good. So we were happy with that. And um, we were just hanging out. I mean, not anything crazy. We we're just hanging out at home then, too. And then um, I let myself sleep in a bit today. And um, I just woke up really not feeling well. But. Um, I took medication and um, we went to the mall that I work at the, like I now am working at the Bath and Body Works at um, because the Bath and Body Works I was working at, la uh, well when I was working for them originally was um, closer to me and this one's closer to Adrian um, but the employees there are so sweet and the girls are just really happy to see me and it's just such a different it's such a different environment and it's really nice <laughs> and um, I just I don't know I'm, I'm really I've been telling everybody today that I'm really grateful that I'm working at this company again today because I really loved the company while I was working for them like I really 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 like them but I was in an unhealthy environment and things got like just too difficult to handle with nobody being respectful of my needs so um, but this environment's so much great, uh, greater. This is 
this environment's better, basically, is what I'm supposed to, what I'm trying to be saying. Um, but anyway, um, I'm just happy that I'm, I'm employed there because I really like the company itself. I really enjoy their products. I enjoy, um, you know, and they're, they're a really solid company, you know, they, they've offered twice in the last like three or three or four years for every, so like for every person working at Bath and Body Works, they've done raises. So like, like a regular sales associate would have been before I worked there or no, when I was working there, working there, it was 10 um, per hour. And then while I was working there, it went up to 12. And then soon after I left, it went up to 14 for just a sales associate. So they really care a lot about their their employees. But anyway, I'm just finishing up with my hair and um, I'll see you guys in a little bit. Hey guys, so it is actually 1.30. Adrian went out with his friends. And so before they went out, everybody was here, which was really nice. Um, he does have to work at 7 a.m. though. So I texted him, I was like, you know, obviously I don't care if you're out, but you have to work in less than six hours, and it's a 14-hour shift. Um, so I just hope he comes back soon. I, again, I really could care less that he's out right now. Um, I'm just watching TV. I tried to do vlog stuff. I was, like, about to throw up earlier, and just today's been really rough with the, um, like, the pain I've been in. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what's wrong. So, yeah, I'm just watching TV, and I'm not sure if I'm going home tomorrow night or if I am staying over an extra night because my pain management appointment is Monday. Um, but I have to food prep for Adrian, um, so I have to stay most of the day so that I could make him food. I'm not exactly sure what I'm making him. I mentioned fried rice. I'd love to try that. Um, and then there's like a home recipe I really want to do, um, like a family recipe of something, but I would be doing it for my family and for not him. Um, so I don't really know how tomorrow's going to go and what the situation is going to be, but um, I guess we'll see. So, um, yeah, I don't have any other updates or anything, so... Thank you guys for watching. I'm sorry if today was a bit boring. Um, the days kind of are morphing into the next. and I'm just quite... Not confused, but it's just like... Clouded. I just feel really clouded. Um, I also can't see, so that's why I keep squinting. But, um... Yeah. I'll see you guys tomorrow then. Thank you guys for watching. Oh, I also really wanted to tell you guys, too, that one of his friends, um, her, or his girlfriend got a, um, I guess, she got accepted on a scholarship to a school that's nearby, so she knows somebody in Adrian's friend group or she knew some of the friend group and then started dating one of Adrian's friends and um they've been dating for like two years I think or something so she actually is a citizen of um England and not the U.S. and so she's been able to be here um for a while but her visa is ending soon so um I'm trying to figure out to do one of those like day cruises or like sunset cube cruises or whatever i think that would be a lot of fun because his friend group i've said this a gazillion times but his friend 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 group is really like family to each other and their family to me too like they're so they're just such good people and i know that we all would really really enjoy doing that everybody gets along everybody's close and i think that would be such a nice thing to do together in the first place but to even do it as like a going away party for her like i think we would just really really um i just really think that we'll enjoy it and that'll be a good a good thing to do so anyway i'll see you guys tomorrow thanks for watching